Alright, hey guys, what's up? This is Thor Robinson 24 and right now uh, we have a, another Marvel Legends review for you. Uh, this one is the Series 7 Hawkeye. Uh, this is a, uh, a pretty awesome figure. Uh, I thought I was going to have him a little a few trades ago, but uh, that turned out to be the Select Hawkeye. That's a cool figure too, if you want to check that out. Um, you know, I got this uh, at the flea market. Uh, that's right. I went to last weekend. Uh, the guy, uh, I, I don't think he knew exactly what he had because um, he tried to sell this to me as a, a legendary rider series just because he came with a. Uh, his bike, which I don't really understand how to how to pose him on it, because like he can't sit on it. He'd be completely bent over or bow legged. He'd be spread eagle if he was riding that bike. So I used it as like he was standing up on it. Uh, but it's a pretty cool piece. It's got a like a thing you can hang it on the wall. So, like, if you're having the Avengers, you know, go fly or whatever, he can be, you know, in any kind of way you can get him up on. You know, it's on uh, the things on a swivel joint, so <clears throat> he can use that. His accessories, he comes with his uh, bow, quiver, and uh, an assortment of arrows. Um, I asked specifically about a few of these. And uh, that guy had no idea because he thought that this was a different figure. So it kind of worked out for me. Um, okay, so he comes with a traditional arrow. No big deal. This one's kind of a prism shape. This one is one of the trick arrows. This one is like a bomb. Uh, one of these, you know, they're all different because Hawkeye uses trick arrows, so, you know, each one has a specific purpose or whatever. And uh, this one has Ant-Man on it, ready to be uh, fired into battle. The Marvel Select one uh, comes with an arrow with Wasp on it. So that's pretty cool. He also comes with the uh, his composite bow. Uh, I clipped a, a piece of that uh, twisty tie and fed it through there, uh, so that way it can rest on that. And I mean, you have to bend it to each specific arrow, but it can rest on that. And each of the arrows, I don't know if you can see, they have a little indent cut out, so it fits in the string. Right, and then you just pop it in and like tighten it and it'll hold it like that. So that works for him. Uh, all these arrows fit in there. They don't have a specific way to go in. It's just an empty hole. And these other ones are just for show. So looking good. I definitely needed this guy for my Avengers setup. So... Uh, here we go. Paint apps, Hawkeye. Uh, he's pretty straightforward, you know, like many superheroes. Um, his suit is uh, blue and purple, uh, mostly purple. Uh, the upper parts are purple. He wears blue pants. The detail is great. Like all these, uh, his uh, arm pads or whatever you want to call them. They are, um, son of a bitch, oh, he's got a, his arm pads are like a bunch of little pouches, so he can hold stuff, and then he's got like pouches on his uh, suit there, you know, these extra piece, that joint's loose, and that's okay. You know, his head is detailed, it's nice, I don't think, uh, 
I don't know how easily this stuff pops off. Don't want to mess nothing up. Oh shit. Let me try it this way. Whoop. Okay. And then you'd probably have to use the hair dryer to take it off. And you know, just a little idea, you know, you could pop on the uh Clint Barnon head. The Barton head from the uh Ronin 2 pack. Uh, no big deal. <clears throat> so for articulation, uh, Hawkeye's head can go 360 degrees as well as pretty far up and he can look down as well. He has a 360 degree shoulder joint which can go all the way which I think it's supposed to go that way. And then he has an additional shoulder joint to hold the bow out farther or closer and this one has it too so you can reach further so he can get the string on the bow nice he's got a bicep swivel double jointed elbow he can spin 360 at his gauntlet here forward and back action with the uh, wrist and he has the uh, fingers that open and close to hold the bow um, it's the same on both hands, just uh, this one looks different because uh, this is the string hand. Hawkeye also has a ab crunch and waist articulation. He has ball jointed hips, which I feel like I'm going to break. So he can go in and out, and if you move it, it can go forward and back. I don't want to snap it. Uh, upper thigh cut, double jointed knee. Uh, he spins at the bottom below the cuff of the boot there. Forward and back action with the ankles as well as the ankle pivot and uh, the toe joints. I love the ankle pivots. I know all of you guys feel the same way. And the toe joints, you know, they really make the poses a lot easier to do. You know, they make them, you know, more, um, you know, lifelike. You can get them to, like, looking like they're running without thinking they're going to tip over, stuff like that. But, uh, <clears throat> nevertheless, uh, this is uh, officially one of my favorite figures. Uh, I never had it before, obviously, so... I got him now, and I will not let him go, so don't ask. <laughs> this is uh, Series 7. Series 7, Hawkeye, Marvel Legends. So, uh, yeah, until next time, guys. This is Thor Odinson 24, signing out.